Hey guys, this is Skylar81501, aka Trent. Um, went to a local card shop and uh, bought a box of uh, 2007 Ultimate Collection uh, Baseball. And I'll show you what I got out of there. Um, first, I'm going to show you a couple baseballs that I got in. I got another baseball coming in that uh probably be here next week, whatever, but it's pretty sweet, so I'll show you that when it comes in. Um, got this Al Oliver. Um, Autographed baseball in the sweet spot and description is 1971 world champs, so that's pretty nice. These balls come with COAs, so but I'm probably going to go get them authenticated by PSA once uh, they roll around to this card shop I go to. Um, they come in uh, about once a month, so got this uh, Brooks Robinson autographed baseball here, signed on the sweet spot. It's a little faded, you know, but it's I mean it's still you know you can still see it so it's pretty nice so those are two baseballs I picked up okay going on to uh, ultimate collection uh, all these cards are for are for sale um, I will trade and right now I've been on a big Tim Linscom uh, buying frenzy in a sort of way uh, um, I'm basically I'm looking for more of the autographs of Tim Linscom um, so if there's something in here that you want and you know and uh you know say it's 15 bucks whatever and you have a lens come that's you know 50 or whatever then we might be able to do a trade in cash or something like that uh but um try to make offers on it uh today and tomorrow because i'm probably i'm probably going to get these listed um most of all of them are going to go on sports lot except for the last one i'll probably put on ebay um, with a buy it, buy it now or best offer. Um, uh, so, you know, make an offer because once they go on sports slot on auction and they get a bid, I can't take them down. They, they, they start, they run the full course and there's no way for me to get them off of there. So once they go on there, there's not a whole lot I can do. So if you're interested, just shoot me a, shoot me a PM, make me an offer and, you know, we'll see what we can do. Um, also, you know, if you have any Felix Hernandez stuff or whatever, I'm, um, uh, kind of big into Felix Hernandez also. Uh, so you got any autograph. And basically I'm only really getting going after autographs or low serial numbered cards or whatever. So it has to be like the low serial numbered cards have to be at least, you know, 50 or less. Um, I prefer more like 25 and less. Um, you know, so if you got like a base card or, you know, a insert card or something like that that's numbered to 25, you know, or, or 50, then I would be interested in both players. Um, I don't really, jerseys I don't really get into too much, so, you know, uh, patches I will, um, if it's a nasty patch, but if, you know, if it's, if it's like just one color patch, then I'm probably not going to be interested in it. If it's like two or, you know, or more colors, I will. So, so here we go. Um, box wasn't that bad, but it, I mean, it could have been better, but, you know, it is what it is. So, got this, uh, Gil Mesh base card. Number to 450. Got this Eric Bedard base card number to 450. This is like my third Eric Bedard out of this stuff. Got a uh, Vernon Wells number to 450. And then the best uh, base card I got this Albert Pujols number to 450, which books for you know four low, ten high. So can't you know can't go wrong with one of the best base cards out of the set. Uh, for Ultimate Star Materials, I got this Mark Teixeira. Um, jersey card and it's with him with the rangers got this uh, miguel cabrera jersey card for the marlins <clears throat> got this uh, don manley for the yankees jersey so it's, it's pretty nice these go for anywhere between five and ten dollars on ebay so um got this uh eric chavez uh jersey card for the athletics Got this uh, uh, Jeremy Hermedia uh, jersey with this pinstripe for the uh, Marlins. Got this uh, Ricky Weeks jersey, number 10 of 25 for the Brewers. Uh, save these ones. Well, that's okay. Got this really nice uh, number 30 of 50 um, ultimate. Um, Ensemble Swatches 3, which uh, David Ortiz, Albert Pujols, and Jose Rios 
So you got the Red Sox, Cardinals, and Mets. So it's a pretty nice card, actually. I didn't look this one up, um, but I think they, they book for about 25 high right around there. I'm not sure what they go for on eBay. My patch patch was pretty sweet. I mean, it was, it was you know, pretty nice. If you're a Boston fan, it was Jim Rice, 5 of 20. Um, it's got two colors. It's got the big red there and the black there. So it's pretty... That's a pretty nice card. If you're a Boston Red Sox fan, you know, if you collect this kind of uh, stuff, or whatever, but that's a nice card. Um, for the uh, Expos or Nationals, um, got this Tim Raines aut autograph, America's Pastime, not numbered. Got a uh, Chad Cordero for the Nationals autograph. And my rookie autograph kind of sucked, unless you're an athletic fan but I got a Kurt Suzuki um, autograph and then the best card probably out of the box you know the rice in the that triple jersey card is pretty nice got this nice Justin Verlander ultimate future signatures um, numbered uh, 14 of 25 so this is probably the probably the one that I probably end up putting on eBay Jim Rice I might depending on what they go for but um, so that's about it. Uh, other than that, uh, that's, uh, that's all I have really. Um, I was trying to dig through some of my cards and stuff to see if there was anything else I could uh, go ahead and you know, do some trading with, whatever. But um, that's about it for right now. So thanks for watching. See ya.